when you look at the crash site, it is remarkable no one was killed. It's been more than eight hours since this morning's crash and they are still working to clear the inbound lanes of the highway. There was a massive explosion and fire erupted moments after the collision just before eight o'clock this morning, sending black smoke billowing. Police say one truck had pulled over into the emergency lane and as the driver... Imagine a bomb going off. Man fights for his life after fiery truck crash. A man is fighting for his life following a horror multi-truck crash which saw a B-double burst into flames on the Western Freeway on Friday morning. Camera footage captured of the aftermath of the crash shows smoldering debris spread across the Western Freeway as large flames and black smoke billows from the scene. Police believe the fiery crash was caused by one truck rear-ending another near Hallett's Way, on the Western Freeway, about 7.45am on Friday. Police said the truck which had been struck veered across the road and skidded for several hundred metres before it burst into flames. Channel 7 cameraman Bryce Holloway, who was driving a kilometre behind the trucks before they crashed and captured the footage, said the scene looked like a bomb going off. It was just carnage, he told radio station 3 or Imagine a bomb going off, it's like that. There's debris everywhere. Road workers in the area ran to the crash site and used fire extinguishers to protect the injured man before administrating first aid. One driver was thrown from his cabin by the impact, eyewitnesses say. A witness told ABC TV he saw a couple of trucks that are close to disintegration. There's many helicopters there, there's police, there's ambulances. It's a disastrous scene, he said. He said he had recently contacted authorities about dangers along the stretch of road, which is being upgraded. I actually called Vic Roads about this section of road. They're putting in a second off-ramp on the Western Highway. Victoria Police Acting Senior Sergeant Mark Dunn said it was believed one of the trucks was leaving an emergency lane when another truck, in the left lane, hit the back of it. Acting Senior Sergeant Dunn said the investigation into the crash was ongoing. Eastbound lanes near the crash scene were closed for more than six hours while emergency services and Vic Roads officers cleared the scene. Traffic was diverted through Bacchus Marsh via Bacchus Marsh Road. One driver, a man in his 40s, was airlifted to the Alfred Hospital with head injuries. A spokeswoman from the Alfred Hospital said late Friday afternoon he remained in a critical condition. Police said the other driver, a man aged in his 50s, was not seriously injured in the crash and is assisting police with their investigation.